Louisiana Democrats may be trying a new strategy against Republican frontrunner for Governor Mike Pence, and it could all hinge on the Senate race. RTV6 reporter Norman Cox explains what's behind this new strategy. Norman? Well, the Democrats' new theme may be to tie Pence to Republican Senate candidate Richard Murdoch through their common opposition to the auto bailout. Democrats say Pence opposed saving Indiana jobs by voting against the bailout, while Murdoch tried to stop the rescue by filing what turned out to be an unsuccessful lawsuit. Is it the plan to try and tie the front-running Mike Pence to the seemingly less popular Richard Murdoch? Or is it simply that Democrats believe the auto bailout is a winning issue in Indiana and they want to tie both Republican candidates to it? When I asked State Chairman Dan Parker about the party's new attack on Pence, he seemed to indicate the latter. He was adamantly opposed to uh, the rescue plan um, put forth by the Obama administration uh, that saved the Indiana auto uh, uh, jobs here in the state. So it does relate, uh, and I think it's quite hypocritical that uh, Mike Pence is featuring um, a GM truck in his ads um, that he wanted that truck to go away. Democrats aren't revealing anything about their internal polling over the auto bailout. The strategy could work both ways. Well, I think it's, it's both, Norm, uh, but the auto rescue, it turned out to not only be uh, successful and just save over 100,000 jobs here in Indiana, but it's also politically popular now as people realize that it was a good thing to do. And Mike Pence voted against the loans to both GM and Chrysler. Of course, it could also be part of an even bigger umbrella strategy. I think it's probably part of a bigger kitchen sink strategy, which is throw whatever you can um, at Mike Pence and see uh, what sticks. I mean, Pence has got the double-digit lead. He's had the double-digit lead in just about every single poll. And unless there's been some, going to be some dramatic shift uh, in this campaign in the next 30 days and some change, you know, Pence is going to be the next governor. A Pence spokesperson called the attack a, quote, Washington-style negative strategy that John Gregg said he wouldn't run. Although Gregg did not initiate this attack, the Pence spokesperson said Gregg should ask the Democratic Party to stop. I'm Norman Cox, RTV6.